Welcome to this video tutorial on the topic of AuraCheck Software 5. This video provides a comprehensive introduction. You will learn about the clinical benefits of the software, the installation requirements, how the software is structured including the system menu, and how scan data can be seamlessly transmitted. AuraCheck is designed for use with a digital optical impression system and visualizes differences between virtual optical scans. These differences can consist of shifts, rotations, or geometric surface changes. Depending on the situation to be evaluated by the dentist, these changes can point to abrasion, erosion, chipping of material, swelling, recession, plaque, or a changed tooth position. The AuraCheck software can be installed on any PrimeScan AC, Omnicam AC, and a Serec AC upgraded to Windows 10 that runs Generation 5 software, as well as on notebooks or PCs. Prior to a notebook or PC installation, please consult our instructions for use regarding hardware and software requirements. Opening the application will automatically take you to the administration phase. The AuraCheck software consists of three phases. In addition to this phase, there are the arrangement phase and the analysis phase. The administration phase is divided into three different sections, patient, cases, and preview. Currently, we are in the patient database of the dentist Densply Serona. By tapping the small down arrow, a drop-down menu is opened from where other treating dentists can be selected. To the left, the database can be searched for a specific patient case. Below is the patient list of the selected dentist. In our case, the patient demo with the first name Gingiva has been selected. In the cases area to the right of it, you can see that a case was already created for this patient. In the rightmost area, a preview is displayed, together with a list of imported scans for this case. For this patient, both the lower and the upper jaw were scanned once in January and once in February. Next, we open the system menu. From the administration phase, you can access the functions Import, License Manager, Configuration, Window Mode, and Exit. AuraCheck data that have the extension .oc, as well as STL data, can be imported. The functions Save and Export, which are grayed out, are not available in this phase. We close the system menu and open the selected case. Now we are in the arrangement phase and the four scans are displayed in the objects bar at the lower edge of the screen. First of all, we reopen the system menu, where the previously grayed out functions Save and Export can now be selected. Similar to the Import function, you can import both AuraCheck and STL data. We close the system menu again and take a look at the options in the page palette. In addition to the function Display Options, you also find the functions Tools, Display Objects, and Analyzing Tools here. We will take a closer look at the different functions in other video tutorials. At this point, we cannot yet move to the next phase, the Analysis phase, since we only have one scan enabled in our Objects bar so far. For demonstration purposes, we tap the second upper jaw scan. This combination now enables the analysis phase. Lastly, we move to the topic data reception. Seamless data reception is guaranteed with the respective application of CEREC software and Connect software from version 5 and up, and also with the CEREC Ortho software from version 2.1 and up. We are now in the Connect software and have already completed both the administration phase and the acquisition phase. When using the Connect software, the step Buckle Byte Registration in the model phase should be completed before sending the model data to the AuraCheck software. If model data is to be transmitted from the CEREC or CEREC Ortho software, 
the set model access step should be successfully completed first. For seamless data transmission, we open the system menu and select the option Run Application. We tap the AuraCheck icon and the AuraCheck software opens automatically in addition to the Connect software. We will then see a notification reminding us that the newly imported model data will remain floating until we decide whether the data should be saved as a new case or assigned to an existing patient case. We confirm by clicking OK and the case is opened. The model data can be saved either from the system menu by selecting Save or by switching to the administration phase. At this point, you decide whether the data should be saved as a new case, deleted, or assigned to an existing case. Just for demonstration purposes, we select the first patient. Now we can choose again between the options Combine and Cancel Floating Case. Since the transmitted data does not match the patient, we will completely delete the floating case. The data transmission can be initiated again from the three aforementioned software types at any time. Thank you very much for your attention. We would like to wish you every success when working with the AuraCheck software.